Hello viewers, in this video I'll be going over natural gas, ETF ticker symbol, UNG. Today we are down 87 basis points and we have about 1 hour and 30 minutes left in trading. On the 1 hour MACD we do see the MACD slowly turning pop negative I mean and we are dipping lower. On the 4 hour chart we do see a reversal on the 4 hour MACD is approaching positive zone and we seem to be at immediate support on the daily chart we start to see a convergence shaping on the daily MACD and we may encounter sideways price action so if we were to head on higher I do see a resistance roughly between the 18-day moving average and the 50-day moving average reason why those price range are in between the support areas that we encounter and since we are below support price it acts as resistance so the support is slightly higher than the 50-day moving average so I do see that as a possibility we may encounter it soon and as for support the immediate support was back in August 5th all-time low and that price of $17.71 so if we were to move on higher, that price movement is roughly around 8.2 or 8.3 percent move higher. And if we were to continue down lower, that price movement is roughly 2.5 percent to reach back to previous all-time lows. So let's head to the forecast model. On here, I'll go day by day where natural gas would head to in the next coming days. So we have one day out, two days out, three days out, four days out, five days out, six days out, seven days out. So back then we see these forecasts and which one of these forecasts we should look at. Ideally we want the forecast to look identical to the current trend. So we have the current trend right here and the trend in question that looks similar to the current trend and this dates back to June 2nd 2011 to August 26 2011 so I'll point out why these two charts are similar so what we have in the beginning we touch the upper Bollinger Band right here and right after that we proceeded to head in down channel for several days we proceeded to break that down channel to touch the upper Bollinger Band right here but we proceeded to head down lower as a result so we see this price action right towards the end and let's just drag this down lower and let's just make this let's say pur purple since it's below the middle Bollinger Band so we start to see the similar price action right here in the beginning touching the upper Bollinger Band right there we proceeded to head down lower for several days then a quick reversal to touch the upper Bollinger Band and then after that the price level retained below the middle Bollinger Band what we see in the current trend so what we have is one two three four points and one two three four points so there is reason to believe that the trends and patterns are the same the forecasts and outcomes should be fairly the same. So again, the trend we took a look at was June 2nd, 2011 to August 26, 2011. Back then, natural gas was up 26 basis points, so not much higher and not much lower. So slightly on the upside, and that is all. If you enjoy this content, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and thank you for watching.